Hard surface modeling, so modeling of things like mechanical objects, can be very tough to learn, especially in Blender. There are so many different tools and each one has to be used in the right way and often in the right order, so as not to turn your model into some mushy, overlapping mess. So when I heard there was a new hard surface course made by Jan van Dan Hemel, or Blender Secrets as he's more commonly known, I wanted to give it a try. So here's my review of his course, which you can check out in the link in the description. It comes with a coupon code, so if you use that, you get 30% off. It's an affiliate link, so you are also supporting me if you choose to purchase it through that link, but it doesn't affect my review. I'll always give an honest opinion, which is pretty easy for this one because I think it's a good course. So let's take a look. First off, who is the course for and is it suitable for beginners? Well, I would say yes, it is. Jan has a very methodical approach that's easy to follow, providing precise, detailed instructions. What differentiates this course from other hard surface modeling courses I've seen, and there aren't many out there, is that it doesn't require the usual hard ops or machine tools add-ons. That in itself makes it more accessible in my opinion. It's not that those tools aren't suitable for beginners, but I feel that working without them gives you a better understanding of the fundamentals. Starting without those add-ons allows you to grasp how things work before incorporating them. When you understand how the fundamentals work, it's much easier to troubleshoot issues that might arise if you do use those add-ons. Also, those tools do cost a fair bit of money, so this course allows you to decide whether hard surface modeling is right for you before investing in the tools that certainly do make the process that bit easier and quicker. So I do like the course from that point of view. So what's in the course? Well, the course flow is nice and simple and mimics the kind of industry flow. You block out the model, then start kind of building it properly with more detail. Then you read topologize, so the model's optimized and suitable for games and animation. Yan details lots of different ways of doing the same thing. So it gives you lots of options and helps you learn the techniques. And you end up with a high quality model suitable for various applications like an animated film or maybe a game. Although to be fair, I haven't got that far yet because that bit's not been released yet. But you can see from the promo images, the final piece, and it looks good. So what did I think of the course? Well, you might be surprised to know that I don't know every single thing about Blender, and I enjoyed working through and picking up a few new skills along the way. I always think it's worth taking courses, even if I might be very experienced in Blender, as there's so much to learn about the program and there's so much I don't know. I worked through the course and found lots of useful techniques and things that I hadn't really considered before. Yan is particularly knowledgeable and does have an excellent grasp of lots of the intricate tools within Blender, which is why his Blender Secrets booklet is so popular and his YouTube channel with the quick tips. I'll put links in the description to those as well, they're very useful. So I thought it was an excellent course, methodical, easy to understand, and very easy to follow. The course also does provide student support, so students can ask questions directly in the comments section under each lesson, so you shouldn't get stuck for too long. But are there any downsides? Well, nothing of note really. One downside, in my opinion, is that the entire course isn't released yet, and I would like to see a complete course when purchasing personally. I would say it's well-priced, and you've got the discount code as well, so use that. That's in the description. So although it's not all being released yet, it is a very comprehensive course and you can see lots of efforts gone into it. So I would say it's good value. Another possible downside is like many courses, it's a follow along style and you can certainly learn a lot from this. Probably one of the best style of courses there is, but I always think that could be improved if there was a little bit more encouragement for the student to go in a new direction and adapt to what they've already made rather than just completely mimicking what the instructor has made. That's not always possible and in many ways not necessary here but it's something that many students like. So if that's you, do be aware that this course doesn't really offer that, but it does certainly give an extremely detailed overview of most of the hard surface tools within Blender. So you'll be able to make something for yourself if you do follow along. The only other slight downside is that because Jan is just one person, although he is responding to all the questions, I can see that it's tough to get to them quickly, especially if you're in a different time zone. So you do have to be prepared to wait a little bit for answers. In summary, this course is a fantastic resource for anyone wanting to master hard surface models in Blender. It has a clear structure, it's methodical, detailed, it's very concise and to the point, and Yan is an excellent instructor. All that together makes it a highly recommendable learning experience. So hopefully that review is helpful. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.